His second game. A few tricks which we saw him apply last week, but this is just a straight drop punt, and it has the carry, and look how much it means to him. Maybe he shouldn't have tried to encourage the umpire to look at the replay. Here's the shot anyway. This is what matters most. And we have a goal each at the MCG. Let's hope it stays at 100%. Keeps that up. I need them from any which way at the moment. And that'll do the job. So he's kicked two. And he's scooting back to the square. He's going to come up now. He's got support. In fact, he clears the path. And Ginevan marks that one and rolls in his third. And that's something at last. Knows where the goals are. That's what confronts him. Beautiful. Caressing goal. Ginevan nailed it. Kicks his first. Kick towards Stasevich. Puts him under pressure. McCreary arrives. Here's Ginevan. Brody Grundy. My check had a couple to beat Ginevan. In a good spot. Around the body ball. Could bounce through. It does. He now has two. That's big. That's a weapon. And he'll celebrate that. No GoPro, but he'll celebrate. It's a bit of chaos here at the moment. Why on? As he slotted it through, he has. So the Pies get two goals in 30 seconds. Yeah, but when you've got a mopper here like that, going around the corner. And kicking truly. Gideon can pop through his second. Calling its biggest lead of the match is 12 points. Got a bit of length in this for the kick around the corner from there. Ginevan, no problems. Collingwood with the first. Now he's got two. For the Bombers. Throw in back towards the centre of goal. Draper, the double-handed knockdown. Oscar Elliott, Martin, Ginevan, got it. He's got three. He's going to have to absolutely flush it from here. Bit of an arc. Oh, yeah. That is superb. Oh, wow. And the celebration <laughs> to follow. Wow. That is magnificent. He's had the long sleeves to the look today and hasn't changed his ability to kick a goal. At Lipinski, nice little step. Oh, pressure down there grows though. Get in it. Have they got a Sunday special to go with Anzac Day? Oh, so special! <laughs> it's getting better and better for Jack! Just needs to pop this through for his third. Doesn't believe in popping it through. Five on Anzac Day. Looking for his first and his side's first. Hooks it absolutely perfectly. The up and coming star. Oh, play on. Kick the first of the match for the Pies. He's got two. Play on. He's got three. There's Jack Ginnivan. 13 goals across his last four games. Jack Ginevan, this last week with illness. And he's been such a handy goal scorer for the Magpies. And they are bringing the heat in this second term. Lowe took out Collier and allows Collingwood in again with a high ball, a big barrel. Ginevan out the back. He'll take it. He'll waltz away. And with all the flair in the world, he'll celebrate early and bang it up into the second tier. Collingwood are on their way. And the young man is enjoying it. Second of it. Set after his Anzac medal win in game 10. Wow. Nerves has never really been a thing for me. Wow. wow. How's wow. that? <laughs> for a kid with some class. I'd love to know the process that they go through when an umpire is as close as the one was who didn't pay the free kick. Ginnivan from the goal line. 
Well, particularly when he had a really good view of it. My attack, off hands. Elliot didn't get all of the handball. Put Ginnivan under pressure. Snap, though, is good. Let's have a look. Ginnivan close to the man on the mark. It's straight. He likes it. Puts both hands in the air. Ginnivan runs into a bit of space. And he's ignored. Now a little chance for Ballard. Left it behind, disappointing Collins. Handball towards Wits. Too hot for him. Ginnivan doesn't miss. Too often on the left. Threads it through the middle. Out the tongue goes. Already produced one clever finish. Ginnivan. Bending ball. <laughs> makes it look effortless. Side on is the style of execution for Ginnivan. Doesn't matter what he does, it's only going in one place. Having a wonderful year. Lining up for goal number 27. And just pops it straight through the middle. So the Pies get their second. Ginnivan gets his first. Gone up. Oh. Cut off by Pendlebury. Just swooped on it. Dished it to Ginnivan. Kicked the goal. Jack's got two. The peroxide blonde hair in his eyes. Off a couple of steps. He's all class, Jack Ginnivan. He was never going to miss that one. And there is the quick reply. In the chain. Aaliyah, though, drops back into the pack. Drops the mark. Ginnivan, the Collingwood crowd rise when he's anywhere near the football. And with speed and aggression, gets through to Ginnivan. Loves a goal. Pies fans love him. Listen to the roar if he kicks it, though. Has he got the distance? Yeah. I think he has. Yeah. Ginnivan's got three. Overly impressed with the method. And this is Jack Ginnivan's lot, but he knows how to silence them. McCreary reels and goes now. It's a two on one. As Johnson didn't quite get the run. Ginnivan at the back. Left foot over the shoulder. Got it. Pies have got three to open the first quarter. Jack Ginnivan looking for goal 34 of the year. 45 metre kick. They rise. They love it. And now Dacos. Ginevan. Can the little man ignite the pies? Mason Cox. Wedged between a couple of dockers. Had the height advantage. Normally does. Deep ball. Meyer check. Ginevan. There'll be some noise. Kicks it. Puts it in the back of the net. Pies are away. Long ball, Lob needed to take the mark, didn't Ginnivan, how clever is he? For the response to this, Justin Longmuir, knowing that this final slipped away, and have a listen to that. From the back there, you see Ginnivan not confident about the distance. A little bit of a stutter step, got really close to the man on the mark, and then he struck it magnificently. And it comes down to this one quarter of football to sort it out, to kick the difference. Ball knocked down immediately to Adams. Crisp, calling with the clearance. See if they can grab some early momentum. Bobby Hill feeds it inside. Ginnivan. Will he take his moment? He does. Welcome back, Jack. Lots of players in the air. Ginnivan ground level. Fourth in a row, Collingwood. Electrify them. Ginnivan has kicked the goal. Collingwood are within three. Holes in this final term. Uh, Swans haven't kicked one since half time. To Goey. Mitchell. Yours end zone. Tumbles a kick high inside 50. Awkward bounce beat. McCartan and Majacek gets to the back. Campbell leaves it behind. Ginnivan doesn't. We've got a potent forward line. Hogan, Himmelberg. Flynn back in the ruck now. Degoe backs his way out of a jam nicely. Found Adams. Found Mitchell. And he found Ginnivan. Off the bounce though. Ginnivan mopped up his own mess. All part of his grand plan. Gets his first. Hunted him. Crisp. Clever enough. Caught by the Dax, but got it to McCreary. Majek lurking for the knock on. Little topo Ginnivan. And he might even get it home. You're kidding, aren't you? Can you believe that? A goal he didn't mean, field take. Rob 
clarity in this team, isn't there? A real strong system. Everyone understands their role. And that's Jack Ginnivans. <laughs> Type of kick. Come on, play him. No problems at all. Jack Ginnivans got a couple. Normally does this pretty well, Jack Ginnivan. That's left the boot really nicely. Three in a row, Collingwood. Neat ball, Maya check. Here he is again, Mark off, having stopped running from the back pocket. The kicker inside 50, Ginnivan the finisher. It was pretty easy, but put it down the mark off. For eight first quarter goals for the Magpies. Ginnivan, yes! He boomeranged it around the post. Creeps to 48. Kick on the way. Yes! Collingwood fans, look at the players. Get over to him and salute. 